All right, so as I'd said in the previous, it died, and uh, I've made a difficult decision with uh, some hardships I've been faced lately. To uh, just gonna just take parts off it I need, take all the turbo stuff out of it, and eventually just turbo this. And then just gonna be selling parts off of it and getting money back for it. So it's a difficult decision, but sometimes you have to make difficult decisions in your life to keep going. So let's uh, get the soft top off this, the hard top off that, and then let's uh, get the red me out of looking good now. Okay, I forgot to turn on the camera because this guy got here and we kind of got in the mood to just go. But after the loud truck goes by, anyways. But we got the hard top off, sadly. But gladly, it's kind of just chilling. Ah, fucker. Kind of just chilling on there right now. But man, does it make the look of this Miata so much different. Goddamn glare, okay. <laughs> but, made the look of this Miata change, hella. We got Gondrel's car right here though. He made the trek out. <laughs> it's an oil pan because I'm too low. It's yeah, he just fixed the oil pan on it. Got it going. Damn. She's a little dirty, but. Yeah. That's too low. <laughs> Mega Man. Like anime. <laughs> <laughs> so, we got the hard top all on. It's all bolted up and everything. Got all the hard top brackets on. Everything's all good. Thank God my cage is a hard dog uh, X-Brace V2 and it actually does clear hard tops, thankfully. Um, so, got that all on. Everything's all good now. Another thing I did was changed out the old blinkers that were in there or turn signals, whatever you want to call them. Uh, the ones that were yellow, I mean, you could see the tint film was just fried. And uh, took the intake ones off of the Turbo Miata. And then I changed out the lenses, because the lenses were like super foggy and bad. They're super oxidized. And I custom made my own out of this sheet here. Cut it, made it. So now it's a perforated like metal thing, looks super dope on there. Um, the lip had broken the other day, or for the last time I drove it basically, it's been a couple weeks. And so I got that all stitched up with some mechanic wire. So the soft top is just kind of just chilling on top of the Turbo Miata right now. I'll be selling the soft top soon. Um, yeah, I mean, it sucks. It sucks it had to happen this way, but, you know, shit happens, life moves on, and uh, you just learn from your mistakes. So, just got to keep pushing forward and uh, keep moving on. Can't let things get you down. They're just a milestone and a little speed bump in the road of life. <laughs>